Hello everyone, welcome, welcome back to another video. I know it's not uh, gaming news, but this is still gaming related. So for most of you that don't know, Rage recently had an event announcing some of their new products, which is including the Razer Blade 17, which is a 17 inch display. Now, I'll, I do have the specs here, so I'll go through some of the specs, but I'm gonna go through the top, um, well, two laptops that are top of the range. I will say the entry level laptop because it is a lot cheaper than the top of the range. But I'll ask, before you start, please be sure to be subscribed to the channel and hope you guys enjoy this video. But let's get into it. So, the top, one of the top of the range laptops, these are the specs, and I will say it's very impressive. Now, it will cost you $3,299, so it is quite expensive. But here's the specs. So there's an Intel Core i7 11 or 11th gen with Windows 10 Home. It is a 17.3 inch 100, uh, 360 hertz display, full HD. So it is very good with gaming, especially if you do some comp a competitive gaming like CSGO, Fortnite, Valorant, and even more. Um, it has a GeForce RTX 3080, so it has a very good GPU in it. And it has 32 gigabytes of RAM and one terabyte of solid state drive. Now this is also the, a very good start of a gaming laptop, but the very top of the range, um, Razer Blade 17 has a 4K display that is touchscreen and is 120 hertz. That has the i9 or Intel Core i9 11th gen, which obviously it does include Windows 10, um, has the RTX 3080 and 32 gigabytes of RAM and one terabyte of solid state drive. But it will cost you quite a bit. It's $3,699. Now, also these are the top four inch Razer Blade 17s, so it will be high spec. But if you're looking to go for a cheaper laptop and you don't really care about the frames or the hertz of your monitor or display, then this could be your best option. So with the entry level Razer Blade 17, it has an Intel Core i7 11th gen, which is not bad at all. It has Windows 10, obviously. Um, it's 17.3 inch and it's 165 Hertz. So it's not as good, but obviously if you aren't someone that really is intense with your displays, frame rate or refresh rates, then this should be perfect for you. And the display is QHD. So it is decent enough to use. Um, has the GeForce RTX 3060 and has 16 gigabytes of RAM and one terabyte of solid state drive. Now this will cost you $2,399, oh, $2, which is a lot cheaper than the second top of the range um, laptop, which is $3,299. So you're looking about more than $1,000 or about $1,000 difference with the entry level and the top of the range normal HD uh, display. Now, I would recommend to get the Razer Blade only if you are someone that likes to game mobily or you just prefer to game on a monitor. Because I mean, honestly, if you have a PC, there's no really need to get a new laptop that costs you quite a bit. And I mean, you could basically build a nice decent PC, a uh, PC setup just for, for the same price and maybe even get a better um, performance. But this is a good start, especially if you are just on the road, um, you don't really want to have a big tower on your desk. So it is a good option for people that don't want to have a lot of big things on the desk. I mean, it's small, it's quite slick, it's nice, it's very beautiful. I mean, it's a good laptop, but that's my thoughts of it. Um, have you guys in the rest of the video. If you enjoyed this one, go check this video out. Go check this video out and subscribe by clicking this button right here. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Please be sure to like and comment below what you want to see next. Hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys, have a great day and yeah, bye.